here we can see 3 5.5 R wins. In this video I will show you the best 15 minute Fibonacci strategy. We need to know the market structure for this strategy and we need to know how to draw the Fibonacci correctly but that's all what we need basically. It's a very easy strategy you will be able to follow it consistently easily if you backtest a little bit before you will use it on the real market. So the entry will be the Fibonacci 0.764, the stop loss will be a bit below the higher low and a bit above the lower high and the day profit will be the Fibonacci minus 0.6. We will get around 5.5 risk to reward ratio every time with this strategy. So the first thing that we need to do is always to identify the current trend. Here we can see that it's an obvious downtrend, price creates new lower lows. And here we can look for an entry if the price will come up and it did. So here is the last lower high and here is the lower low. The Fibonacci 0.764 will be the sell limit. The stop loss is a bit above the lower high and the take profit will be the Fibonacci minus 0.618. Let's see what's going to happen. We can see that we could have another entry here. Here is a new lower low and a new lower high. So here we did get another entry. We can see that the price created a double bottom pattern and then it came back to the entry point. So if we didn't put the stop loss into break even on the first trade, we would risk 2% on one move which is a bit risky. If we did put the stop loss into break even then we did get stopped out at break even with the first trade. But for the sake of example let's say we didn't put the stop loss into break even we can see that the price did reach the take profit on both trades. So this is a 5.5 R win and under 5.5 R win. So overall we did get plus 11 R with these two trades but we did risk a little bit more than we should. Let's see what's going to happen. Here we can see another new lower low and lower high so we can use the Fibonacci. We can see that with this candle the limit would have been activated so the stop loss is a bit above the lower high and the take profit is at Fibonacci minus 0.618 again. Let's see what the price is going to do. We can see that the price did create a double top then it did go down all the way to the take profit so this is under 5.5 r win so here we can see 3 5.5 r wins which is 16.5 r in total from three trades on the 15 minute chart but to be honest i don't really recommend the 15 minute it's not fast but not slow either so you will need to monitor the trades for a relatively long time and you will need to look for setups longer than you ideally should but i know a lot of traders use this time frame and i'm not saying it's bad it's just too time consuming in my opinion i think if you want to day trade you need to trade on the one minute or maximum at the five minute and if you want to swing trade then you will need to trade at least the one hour chart but as you can see this strategy works fine on any time frame you can use any normal strategy on the 15 minute time frame for this strategy you just need to know the market structure use the fibonacci put the limits in that's all you need to do and you will be profitable of course you're not gonna get 100 win rate with this strategy or with any strategy you will get around 40 percent with this strategy if you use trade management but that is still amazing with 5.5 risk to reward setups every time but the main goal with every strategy is to make it as easy to follow as possible so you will be able to follow it under high pressure and this strategy is very easy so definitely give it a try at least on backtest so i hope you enjoyed this video if you want to know what is the best supply and demand strategy check out the next video